Hi, I'm Charlie Beasley, a consultant at the Global Leadership Advisory and search firm Egon Zender. I'm also a co-founder of EZ+, the Egon Zender LGBTQ and Allies community. We're delighted to have Julia Hoggett, who is the CEO of the London Stock Exchange, formerly Director of uh, Market Oversight of the Financial Conduct Authority, and that followed a, a stellar career in investment banking. Um, you are one of the most influential women in finance and also an advocate of LGBTQ inclusion around the world. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Julia, I wonder whether we could just start with a question around boards and LGBTQ mm -hmm. inclusion. Um, I'd just be interested in your perspective on where does having a diverse board um, add value to you as a CEO? Ooh, which, how long have you got? So, <laughs> so I have a, to start with a very simple principle of decision making. The more perspectives you bring to the table, the greater the chance that you make a good decision. And I have a very simple philosophy of decision making, which is I don't need to be right but I need us to get to the closest to the right outcome that we can do as a group. Um, and I very much work on the basis of having very collaborative boards where you have lots of open discussion and you're really getting the experience um, that the board has. The more experience it has, the greater breadth it has. And diverse boards, in my experience, actually do generate better challenge, better perspectives, and also can take you as an organisation in a direction that you might not have gone in um, had you just had people who were very content to keep doing the same thing over and over again. Um, so I think it's incredibly valuable. And I'm just going to ask one follow-up mm -hmm. question. In terms of bringing LGBTQ uh, board members yep. in and, and what they might bring to the board, do you have any views on that? Um, it's, it's interesting because in the UK context, obviously, there's, there's now been a transition in terms of looking at gender and ethnicity, but not at LGBT yet. Um, there are vast swathes of different forms of diversity, which I think we need to be able to increasingly be able to acknowledge and understand within board dynamics. But LGBT, I think it is partly the experience of, of otherness and difference and difference of perspective um, and willingness to challenge and willingness to think of oneself as an insider and an outsider. All those things I think that actually you bring as a gay person into the workplace, it's really valuable that board members do it as well. Um, I don't think of boards as rubber stamps. I think of them as genuinely challenging environments to help us all get to a better organisation and to govern it to get there safely.